Welcome to the first installment of my series on creating a lintel cut print. Lintel cut is a printmaking technique in which a sheet of linoleum is carved with a special gouge. The uncarved areas, which represent the image, is now rolled with ink. Paper is placed on its surface and pressure is applied either by hand or by using a printing press, resulting in a printed image. In this video we will learn how to cut and square the linoleum. We will also demonstrate how to transfer your drawing to the block. Use a carpenter square to find the right angle of one side. Continue to its other side, marking a perpendicular line. This will later receive the first cut. Very lightly start your score. And make it a little deeper as you go. If you bear down too hard, you'll get out of your line. There you go. Oh, just break, break this up. come back here and just cut that off. Now as you use your block you may have you may have little stringies come out of there so as you use it be sure to cut those off. We're going to cut the rest of this off here. So very light. Watch your fingers. Um, this is the one that I want. I'm going to transfer this image to it. And what you want to do is if you have a uh, drawing uh, and you want to you know, protect your drawing, just make a photocopy of it, but you have to draw back into it, unfortunately. And there are two ways you can do it. I would recommend using charcoal because uh, it'll transfer better. This is actually charcoal. all of you to uh, do misdirection on them. Tell them the wrong information. This is not fixed in here. That's just charcoal. So if I'm going to throw me the thick, uh, thick one. There you go. That's good. And what we want to do is go back over this to set that into the block like that. Yeah, make sure you're doing an image you like because you will be doing the same thing over and over and yeah. over again. <laughs> you will know your image inside and out. Next time we'll be covering color transfer, which you'll, you won't have to redraw it for that. But you will have to be very careful about your alignment. Okay, and um, that's how you do it. And now what you do is um, go by this rule. Anything that is uh, dark, like a dark mark, you leave it that you want to keep dark. Anything that you want to not print, you have to carve it out. Uh, if we were going to carve it, would we want it carved out like this? No, we probably wouldn't. Why? How would we want it carved out? Remember what we talked about? We want to think of this not as a line drawing, but you want to think of it more like a bolder, more brush stroke kind of feeling to it. Uh, not necessarily that this is not good, um, but I think for this first assignment, I want you to think bolder on it. I don't want you to get caught up in little details. I really want you to um, get very expressive and bold with these things. Mm -hmm. 